Yep. Show, it's up. Okay. So um, good. Uh, so for my project, I um, chose to do uh, something fairly simple. I wanted to just um, take a few, like, uh, like I guess internal data categories um, from the from the big da data set and just see how they map map together. So I chose um, I chose uh, ra I, 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 um, race uh, and then how and how that mapped on with like basically em employment rates and um, uh, spouse spousal. So that those are the spouses. It's a bit of a lim lim fairly limited um, data uh, group, but um, it, it mapped interestingly. So um, computation, computational thinking, um, I figured I would be splitting data, analyzing data, visualizing that. I mean, we've all seen this, I'm sure. Um, here's a picture of our favorite book here. Um, so um, I definitely, I don't, know, I don't know, should I read all my strengths and weaknesses? Uh, Tableau, uh, I, I use Tableau uh, mainly in uh, data sets, which is, um, I didn't, I didn't um, use it to map individual jobs or individual like people. I um, basically grouped them together and uncalculated like whole employment rate or whole spouse rate or, and so things like that. So I used it for more for like um, looking at the uh, large, larger scale data and, and not the smaller scale. I think uh, personally, I find it more um, useful for that. So here, we'll just move on. Okay. Um, so, here are just some of my initial, these are like, these were just my introductory like calculations or sheets. Um, I started off with just like race, basically just calculating um, the data sets by each, by each of the categories. So race, spouse, and then a job. So we, you know, we see uh, out of the 15, 70, 710, there's uh, about, there's uh, 11, 000, like 11,000, um, fall in the white category and about uh, 45 fall in the black and um, the data just continue scrolling I have the percentages here um, so yeah about 70 percent of the data set are, is marked as white and um, the, well, the rest is black <laughs> um, that's not that's wrong number. Anyway, wrote that wrong. Um, <clears throat> from that though, we, we see uh basically who is like thirty seven point three six have spouses. So sixty two percent don't have spouses. So the mar the marriage rate um for at least in the male marriage is uh relatively low. That is what we see, and um most people have jobs in the from the, in the data set have a job associated with them, and so. From there, I went on to like uh, just combine, just combine all the data sets slowly, and so here we see like uh, we the job job plus spouse. Um, it's mapping. Um, so by color is spouse the the darker blue is is with a spouse, and the lighter blue is without a spouse, and so we see what we'd expect. Um, if you don't have a job, you're less likely to be married, or have a spouse. You know. Um, it's, it's close to 50, 50, but, um, what we do see is, uh, that even amongst the working population, a lot of people are not, do not have spouses. <clears throat> um, and so here we see, I mapped a job with, um, with racial, um, categorization. And so, uh, blue is with blue is job, gray is no job. And then there's black and white. So we see here, um, just about everybody has jobs. My population is slightly bigger, so they're slightly higher, more more people unemployed. But we will see um, percentage-wise, there are black um, labeled, the employment is higher by about seven, by about 7%, you <clears throat> see. Um, and then here, uh, spouse with race. So we we see the uh, the percentage-wise for, um, in terms of the black labeling and the white labeling, labeling um, spouse, uh, who has spouses, it's actually about, it's about equal. There's um, there's a like 0.9 percent difference um in favor of the of the white label pop population, um, but it, it's it's very very close, which I I found interesting, um, because I, I know generally that they, they work in the lower income jobs, but it's interesting to see if and look at other data sets. 
So here we see, yeah, so uh, 37, 37.65 of the white um, on the population have spouses and uh, 36.66 of the black on labor, on label have spouses. So it's very close. Um, and then uh, finally, I, um, I just combined them all into uh, one big data set, basically. So I could just kind of map everything on together, which um, I, I actually found something quite interesting, I thought. Um, we've been talking a lot, a lot about archival silences um, uh, this uh, for a lot of presentations today. And um, I believe um, what we see here, well, if we remember back, uh, the marriage rate, the spousal rates and um, are very similar amongst the um, here um, amongst the, uh, the the white and the black populations, but we do see that amongst the um, here here it is amongst the unemployed um, white population, like people who have spouses, it's about it's only seventy seven amongst um, amongst the black population versus uh, three hundred ninety three amongst white population. So it's a difference of. Um, I have it written down. It's a difference of sixty-seven point two four percent between those between those populations. Whereas, and if you consider ju just spousal by itself, um, not including job, it's uh, there's only a difference between zero point nine nine. So, uh, some of the more interesting things I I thought by kind of conducting this little experiment um, with the with the data uh, is a uh, I'm I'm assuming that um, without being able to like quite tell how old they were exact all the all old they were exactly that what we're see what we see um, in the big on the large unemployed but married um, white population is probably people who are retired um, and as is as like is revealing um, I mean I ever I mean it's obvious like the economic inequality I mean that's that's not really surprising to anyone but it's interesting to see how it manifests um even in places like where you initially wouldn't have looked for it I mean it doesn't it does make sense on on second thought but I, I, th I thought I found it kind of interesting when I first noticed this so and this is kind of the conclusion of my of my thing and I have a I have a lot of like kind of just um uh the percentages um yeah, so that I've all, I just have I just concluded with all with all the percentages. Excellent.